Millions of holiday travelers being met with picketing pilots today at major airports across the country, protesting massive flight delays and cancellations that have made travel this year a nightmare, not only for passengers. The, the cancellations are frustrating for the pilots as well. We, we sympathize with our passengers because it affects our lives as well. Pilots from Delta, United, American, JetBlue and Spirit picketing at 12 major airports, including Chicago's O'Hare and New York's JFK, demanding management fix operational problems. Delta releasing a statement saying in part, our goal remains to continue providing Delta pilots with an industry leading overall contract with the best compensation based on pay, retirement work rules and profit sharing. A new report from the Department of Transportation finds passenger complaints were up 35 percent in June compared to the prior month. The airlines blaming staffing shortages, a resurgence in travel demand and severe weather for the travel chaos. Transportation Secretary Pete Buttigieg sending a letter last month to the CEOs of major airlines demanding they do better. Today, the DOT launching a new website that lists what airlines owe travelers for various flight disruptions, including things like meal vouchers and refunds. Airlines insist the picketing pilots are off duty and so won't affect operations. But if you're one of the 13 million people expected to travel this Labor Day weekend, experts advise pack a big bag of patience because airlines and airports are still understaffed. Despite that new DOT website for passengers, 38 attorneys general sent a letter to lawmakers this week criticizing the DOT's response to consumer complaints, asking them to shift authority to the states and other agencies like the Department of Justice. Alexis Christophorus, ABC News, New York.